Bad things that they wish and 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 on me. Alexa off! Alright, hello. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Barcelona B2 Beats career mode. I haven't said that in a while. As you can see, I'm pretty much in the exact same outfit as I was not last time. No, I didn't record this right after. It's, uh, it's, it's, it's just really cold in San Francisco. I've been living in LA for the past, like, four years, so this is the only sweater that I have. I can't afford a new one because I spent all my money on this goddamn bike that sounds the same. So she would like to go ahead and donate. Hi, I'm minor internet celebrity and the greatest digital manager in FIFA 18 history. Be modest. And for the low cost of $1 per month, you can help support a noble cause, keeping fat Asians warm. Usually, fat Asians are native to tropical climates where they can thrive and eat kimchi. But because of global warming, fat Asians have been forced to migrate from their native climates to much colder ones. This, in turn, causes them to massively shiver and consume less food, thus becoming skinnier. Please, donate. You can make the difference and keep Asians fata. Thank you. <coughs> but anyway, let's get into the episode. We currently sit on the final week and a half of the January transfer window. We got one game to play up against Accrington, and then we're on to the transfer deadline day. And once we are past that, got about three months worth of games, and then we're done. So honestly, we're gonna do this transfer window, and then I'm gonna super sim up, because as we are releasing on today, uh, we're already into March, I'm behind schedule, but America Ruins Everything Career Mode is coming right, right up. So, here's the crucial thing. Vote up an I think is right now. We probably only have a couple more episodes worth of this. Do you want me to just continue to, to sim this on, or just take it as far as I can and then just drop the series uh, when eventually, you know, America uh, Ruins Everything Career Mode is up? But a couple other updates, if you didn't catch the last episode, click on the app thing that's over here, that'll drag thing out, you can click on that episode. But, uh, for all you guys who want a quick little catch-up, uh, we did sell Wilfred the Captoom, and that gave us 1.4 million. We attempted to go in for Thomas Among, who's one of the best young cheap strikers that you can get in the game. He's also Cameroonian, so I was thinking, you know, the lineage of Eto and whatnot, go ahead and bring them through the system, but we did... You know, we went into a little bit of a kerfuffle when it came on to wages, so I'm going to attempt to grab him again in this episode. And also, we have to go ahead and raise up a lot of these youngsters, because apparently I got to play them in like 10 matches. And I think I barely have about 10 matches <laughs> left in this season, so I don't I don't know if I'm going to be able to accomplish that. Alright, we can go back in for Thomas Among now. Uh, it's back to square one, though, so we're going to have to approach to buy them. I think the original... Uh, in terms of purchase was 1.2. Let's go a little bit below. So let's go in for 1.1111. Submit the offer. See if they go. 1.5. Okay, so we got him for 50k cheaper. Let's not mess this up this time. Let's go in for Mr. Among. I think we offered him four. No, we offered him like two. And we'll definitely offer him at least five this time. So let's offer him six. It's fine, we can afford it. It's good, that's a fair offer. My client is happy. So let's go bro, welcome to the squad, Mr. Thomas Among. He isn't the highest rated, yes, he's 67 overall, but he's got a potential of 83. And what I love about him is right there. Acceleration 85, agility 81, 90 balance, 87 jumping, 86 sprint speed, and 82 strength. A goddamn tank. 71 aggression too, which is nice for a striker. Uh, issue is we got to get his finishing up. Only 66 and then a lot of his technical sets. They're not the best. You know, I'm, I'm not going to be truthful about it. But physically, he is a mini tank. 5'9", 3-star with skill moves, 3-star weak foot. You know, you know that's it. It's okay, but Cameroonian, remember he's only 19, he's only going to be growing, he's one of the best young strikers uh, playing in the world right now. This is a huge coup, and he's got the long shot taker trait, I like it, I like it a lot. He's pretty much going to be a super sub for now though, because his finishing isn't that high, and also his stamina is only at 60. It leaves us about 400k and 4k uh, in the budget, 
do can't we can we pick up one more actually i'll save that until after this match let's get in let's use our new toy up against actorton stanley all right big boys uh jazwiak or yazwiak out on the left side are nath up front lozano vatino who's been sensational uh since we brought on mr bernard Lionel messi in the midfield alenia uh, busquets bueno correa sesignon and ortola in between the sticks let's get it in let's do this Accrington. one game of the day let's make him pay oh terrible pass <gasps> oh my god we got <laughs> what all right the keeper comes off his line what? <laughs> he tackled his own guy. I have no idea what's going on, but Messi, put this away, please. Oh, no! <laughs> the humiliation! Oh, it is not a good day for Mr. Keeps. 16, bro. 16. Oh, and Messi, the ghost that he is, teleports through the cameraman and then gets a blowjob from the chocolate Lozano. This is incredible scenes. Incredible scenes in League 2. Off, he pretty much saved it. And somehow he dick punched it. <sighs> when it's not your day, it's not your day, bro. <laughs> just, uh, if I was that manager, I was like, I think I'm just gonna sub him off. <laughs> Yo! All right, I take it back, man. Ever since uh, that early Gafu, he's kind of gathered his nuts and he's been putting on a show. Look at this, beautifully shaped. And what a save from the keeper. Oh, and that surely is a goal. I was about to say, Acton's been doing really well to attack our wings, put pressure on our back three, and we have not been able to keep up. 40 second minute, tie game. We dominated early on. I felt like we had some decent chances, but hats off to Acton. They have been really good on the counter. Oh, brilliant play. Messi's gonna turn him. End it. End it. Messi! Oh my god! How sway. EA hate Messi. It's it's clear. Because there's no way he should be missing that. Oh, let's go! Catch oh no! Let's go! Oh my god! I'm cursed, bro. I am cursed. There's a lot of bad things that they wish and they wish and they wish. Oh my god. Accrington, you lucky bitches. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. Get the fuck out. Oh my god. We got caught out. No, God. No. No. Yes. <laughs> oh god. Yeah, you saw it. <laughs> like. Messi got in a great position, Ateki got in a great position, Amon got in a great position. Lino Messi had eight shots, zero goals. <laughs> Tell me that they haven't nerfed him. It's not like he's gone down in rating. There has to be like some secret stats, conspiracy theories, tinfoil hats, there's Illuminati confirmed. Fucking bullshit, bro. I mean, look at this shit. 16 shots, 11 of them on target. One goal! One! We may not work them, we had more tackles and everything, but I'm... There'll be days like this, bro. There'll be days like this. All right, I need to cool down. I need to drink a little bit of tea. Gotta go into my happy place. Have a let's just trade up a little bit and then we'll finish off this transfer window and end up this episode. Nice little tidy one today. Just like that, transfer deadline day is shut. We're now in February and we're gonna be simming up. I think the next episode, we're gonna be seeing us in the new transfer window in fact what i'm gonna do right now is i'm gonna sim to the end of the season and then you can see kind of like the end of the season stats and all that Go time with it. all right we're in june of 2018 let's see the end of this season over here check out the player stats all right you know as to be expected Lionel messi scoring 20 goals although right behind him is piatti as well as uh, stuani of the two over catalonia sides Anyone else? Ooh, are not picked up 15, also from Barcelona B. Let's go over to assist. Duani goes ahead and he takes it. There's actually no one on here from Barca B. Very, very interesting. And then on to the clean sheets. Ortola had 11, but wow, Girona had 21 clean sheets. 
Jesus Christ. Oh, interesting. So in League Two, it's four teams that go ahead and get promoted. I'm sorry people were yelling at me in the comment section uh, about that. But we got automatic promotion. We did finish in third. Three Catalonia sides ran away with it, as predicted. All right, let's see the end of the year squad report really quickly. Artola's gone up by plus two. The other keepers we haven't really been worrying about. Palencia's gone up by plus three, all the way up to 71. Bueno's gone up by plus five, all the way to a 71. Very nice for him. Turin's gone up by plus two. Folly. Uh, Quinza's gone up by only one. Alfon, though, it's because we recently just put him in, but this is the guy. Damn, look at that center back, right back, CM, CDM, four star weak foot. This is the French center back that is going to be our future right here. He's got, I think, like 83 to 89 potential and someone we definitely have to put through the training regimen next season. Costas is up to a 72. Kukurea has gone up by plus three up to a 71. Session's gone up by plus four to a 71. Uh, let's see. Aranjo's gone up by plus three. Uh, Ruiz has gone up by plus two. Ateki's gone up by plus two. Not all too happy, but, you know, it happens. Damn, Busquets went up by plus six up to a 72. Yosbiak's gone up by plus six. Contra's gone up by plus two. Alenia's gone up by plus three, almost to 80 now. Uh, Meyer's gone up by plus four. I think he's our scout future star. Velasquez uh, is another one of our, our talented youngsters. He's gone up by plus three up to a 60. Uh, it's five. Arnath is up to a 76. Had a fantastic season, by the way. Cardenas is uh, it's just hovering at a six. I think we just signed him up. He's 80 to 83 potential. Not bad, not great. vatino has gone up by plus four, up to a 74. Perez is up to a 69. Lionel Messi staying hard at a 93. I guess he's got enough playtime, although he probably will begin to degrade next season. alfaro has gone up by plus two. Thomas Amay has gone up by plus two, up to a 69. I like that. Let's take a closer look at his. Didn't go up in any of the sprint stats, but look at that bounce, that strength, and all that whatnot. He's already up to 84 strength. That is incredible at age 20. Devontae Cole's gone up by plus two. Uh, Lozano's gone up to a 74. Jack Chan Singh and all these other guys are okay. Ruiz is up there. Santana, this is one of our other brilliant youngsters. Four-star skill moves, two-star weak foot for Mario Santana. Very, very nice. And he's the guy who's like 92 to 94 potential. I think it's the same with Gomez over here. He's also got four-star uh, skill moves, and he's at a 58. So that is going to be our roster heading into the next season. Remember, we're also bringing a lot of pre-contracts. We've got a lot more depth in the midfield, center backs, uh, full backs, as well as Bernard, who can play Cam or any of the wings. So really, really interesting. Let me know in the comments down below who should I be looking into. But I think the biggest thing that I want you guys to go ahead and vote for is remember, how would you like to see the rest of the season play out? Just play it out normally until the end or try to rush really quickly all the way, super sim up to the Premier League season. Yeah, that's pretty much it for me. If you want to be entered in to go ahead and win a blue Yeti, go ahead and click on this video right here. I'll take you to experiment where I do all the last of things. If you want to get all caught up on this career, go ahead and click on here things foods and yeah i'll be streaming this saturday probably and sunday when uh, this thing comes out so go ahead check me out and uh yeah good stuff anyway my name is b minus hope you guys are having a wonderful day remember to stay yourself stay humble and until next time stay chubby